Welcome back. We told you it's college colors day and tailgating season is certainly heating up, but you can also bring summer into the party well into football season too. And here to keep the warm weather vibes going is Benny Ulloa from Emiliano's and Benny, you're going to teach us how to make some summertime drinks and carry them into football season. That is correct. Uh, thank you very much for having me. Uh, yes, we're going to be trying some of the features we have at the restaurant, um, some very fruity and, uh, and delicious drinks that we came up with a couple months ago. I can't wait, but first I have to tell you congratulations on 15 years. It's amazing. It's been a, it's been a journey and, uh, and we certainly appreciate the uh, patronage from uh, everyone in Pittsburgh. So yeah, we love it. Love it too. Okay, well I can't wait to dig in and learn how to make a good margarita, although I know you're going to make it better than I am. So you're going to make a dragon fruit margarita. This is new on the menu and I'm doing a watermelon margarita. Correct. That's okay. right. Uh, we'll, we'll, I'll just kind of walk you through and then we'll, we'll see. Okay. We'll see what kind of, uh, if you can make it a great bartender. So. <laughs> I did do it once in college. I, I got to tell you, I wasn't very good right. at it, but hopefully this will be better with that's your right, help. That's right. That's right. We'll start with the ice. So go okay. ahead. All right. So we're going to fill up one of these things with ice. I can't wait to shake like Tom Cruise. Right. Okay. That's the fun part. So yeah, we'll, we do the same. And then you were talking to me about tequila and how important it is to use the right tequila and the best tequila if you're going to make a good drink. That's right. Uh, I mean, um, you refer to college. You know, back in those days, we were using plastic bottles. Right. <laughs> and different kinds of tequila. <laughs> yeah. Today, we're going to be using El Tesoro uh -huh. tequila, which is uh, a premium tequila uh, of ours. And, um, and, it's, and it'll make a great margarita for sure. Yeah, so. smells good too. I would use this. Oh, you have one. Okay, so. Uh, and you said three parts. Three parts tequila, one, uh, one part uh, orange liqueur. And so you said orange liqueur, and we're both using the orange liqueur? That's correct. Also filling this up to about the top here? Uh, yes. There you go. Okay, here you go, Benny. Thank you very much. All right, pouring that Thank in. Go this way. And now, is there anything else that's added into? Yes, in your case, you're going to be adding the watermelon chunks there. Okay. And is there any rhyme or reason and just add a couple of them or how many? Uh, it just depends on how strong the flavor you want it to be. So okay. The, the flavor of the fruit oil to, to get into the drink there. So uh, okay. I went heavy with uh, with that. And then this is when we get to do the fun not part. Yet, not <gasps> yet. We, we have to do, uh, in your case, yeah, you're, uh, we're using these um, uh, uh, syrup that we make at, uh, at the restaurant. So uh, watermelon syrup okay. there. Okay. And is there, how much do I, am I putting in yeah, there? Yeah, go ahead and a little more. A little more? Yeah. This is where the this is where the sweetness comes in, right? right? Exactly. All sweetness right. and, and flavor. Oh, see, so you use that. I'm. Just it's okay. It it's in okay. There. It's okay. All right. And now, and now. I've watched we, David do that. You gotta right, pop it in. Got, no, we we have to put a, a, one more, and I'll just do it. This <laughs> okay. There we go. <laughs> All right. Now I can pop the top exactly. on, right? Exactly. Okay. Ready? Yeah. And is there anything special? You, can you flip it up or do anything fun? You can, you can get as creative with it if you want. I just want to make sure I don't get it everywhere, so. <laughs> that's all. That's all I got. But what is this? Is this tahini? That's tahini. Yeah, that's a mixture of, uh, let's keep that here. <laughs> uh, it's a mixture of dehydrated lime juice, mm -hmm. salt, and pepper. So look at that. You can see that all Pretty. And that's going to add a little bit of spice to that sweetness. Correct. Right. I would uh, put a little more uh, ice in there. So put a little bit more ice in your cup. Yep. Just making a mess over here. Why not, huh? End go. the week off on a high note. And special touch. And David has always told me about this, the garnish. And for the watermelon, you dip it back into the tahini. Tahini, exactly. And then you have to cut it so, so perfectly so that it can just hang exactly. right there on the side. Exactly. Look at that. Look how pretty. What are some of these other things that you've had added here? Uh, we have some uh, dehydrated uh, oranges. In my case, I'm going to use one of these uh, dehydrated uh, Limes. Uh, lime wedges. Can I add Can a couple more watermelon chunks? Of course, yes, of course. You know, you I like to get those at make the it as end, fun as possible, you know? so. Cheers uh, to you, Benny, and congrats again on 15 thank years. Thank you very much. Thank you, Pittsburgh. Uh, you, you don't want to try mine, although <laughs> I can't wait to try it, but go see the professionals and have it done right. Thank Cheers. You Oh, I love that tahini. So good. And thanks to Benny. And I can tell you right now, this is perfect for late summer parties, tailgates, even at home. For more information on the delicious drinks and bites at Emiliano's, you can go to PittsburghTodayLive.com. We'll be right back.